Hi, I'm John with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember that anytime you work on an appliance, make sure that it is unplugged or the circuit breaker is turned off so there is no chance of electrocution. We're going to show you how to install a new ribbon cable harness for your Frigidaire refrigerator. It's a really easy job that only requires a small Phillips head screwdriver, a normal size Phillips head screwdriver, a pair of needle nose pliers, and a few minutes of your time. When you open the package, you'll get one new ribbon cable harness. The reason why you'd be replacing the ribbon cable harness is if the water dispenser won't dispense water or if the ice maker won't dispense ice. The part is located in the dispenser area of the freezer door. Start by removing this bottom tray assembly. To do so, grab on and pull it straight out, which will release it, and now you can remove it. Use a Phillips head screwdriver to loosen and remove the three screws that hold this whole piece in place. Now that the three screws have been removed, you can lift up on this front panel, which will unclip it, releasing these two tabs here that go in the front of the freezer door. Afterwards, lower down the front panel to reveal one end of the ribbon harness. Grab it with your fingers and carefully pull straight out, which will release it. Set the front panel on a suitable work surface, then turn it over to access these four screws. Use a small Phillips head screwdriver to loosen and remove the screws. Then lift up and remove this white panel. Turn it over. And you can see how this ribbon goes into the computer board here. You'll need to lift up on these two small tabs here to release the ribbon. So just slightly pull them out. And afterwards, you can remove the ribbon. Here's the old ribbon cable harness next to the new one. If you already have the new part, great. If not, you can get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. Install the new ribbon cable harness so that these metal terminals are facing up. Insert the new ribbon cable harness into the connector. Then, press down on the two locking tabs. Then, reinstall this control panel onto the front panel. Carefully set it in place. And then, thread in and tighten the four retaining screws. Afterwards, we can now reinstall the front panel. You'll now be ready to connect the other end of the ribbon to the main control panel here. The lower side of the ribbon has a bunch of red lines, so you'll want to turn it over, which will reveal wording that says up. From there, you're going to position it and then press it into place. Once connected, we're going to reinstall this front panel. There's two mounting clips that need to go into these two holes. So we're just going to align those. And then you're going to press down to clip them into place. Then thread in and tighten the three retaining screws on the bottom of the panel. Afterwards, reinstall the bottom tray. Now that the part is installed, plug in the refrigerator and you're done. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. And be sure to check out our other repair videos on our website, on our Facebook page, and on our YouTube channel.